Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So first of all, I really wanted to thank you because you really seemed to like my last video about minimalism and this is a subject that is really close to my heart. So I'm really glad that you liked the video and I hope that this video will inspire you and so thank you so much <laughs> um, today i wanted to talk about my theme for 2016 this is a concept that i discovered through the um, a video from lavender uh, i'm gonna link her video in the info box below so i decided to do the thing for me so what is the theme a theme it's a word or maybe a few words that are going to be your guides for your year and I chose to select a macro theme and a micro theme <laughs> the first one will be like the big picture of your year the big goal if you want and the micro theme will be more for your daily life so the macro theme that I choose for myself is the discovery uh, the learning process. <laughs> I really want this year to learn and to discover more. Um, my boyfriend and I, we moved here in Gaspésie um, maybe two, almost two years ago and when we moved we really wanted to discover the place even though my boyfriend um, is native from here. He didn't discover a lot of the kind of the place, and we really wanted to go on walks and discover and just appreciate the wonderful um, land and the wonderful nature here. But we didn't. We didn't do half of what we wanted to do um, because we gave us excuses. So this year, I really want to change that. I really want to explore and discover new place and really enjoy the... I want to discover new people. I want to meet you new opportunities. I want to get out of my box, <laughs> get out of my comfort zone and challenge myself. The second theme is my micro theme. It's more for my daily life and it's to be more conscious. So right now in the actual society, we are not conscious about our lives. We do things automatically. We um, creates routine and we don't know what we do you know we, we always do the same we wake up we prepare for the day we go to work then we go back to work do, we go back from work and then we eat and do the dishes and clean and then we go to sleep to sleep and we haven't been conscious all day long we haven't realized what we did and we were not present during the day and the day is already gone <laughs> so what I really want this this year is to be conscious is to be aware of what I do in the moment and really think about what I do and why I do it and Last week I uh, watched a video on YouTube, I'm gonna link it down below because it was really interesting and the guy talked about philosophy and he said that um, you, if you want to be happy and have a meaningful life you have to know who you are and where you are right now and you have to think about the person you want to be and where you want to be, you wanna, where you want to go. <laughs> and you when you you realize that you realize also that there is there are a lot of contradiction between the person you are and the person you want to be and if you want to be happy then you have to eradicate those contradiction you have to work to be the person you want to be and then you re you realize also what are your values and that you want to do things that are in 
that are corresponding to your values. You don't want to be wrong or do something that you don't like. So this video was really interesting. He also said that once you are working to be the person you want to be, then you realize what is your real purpose in life. And if you're working according to your values and if you're working to be the person you want to be and you want to eradicate this contradiction, then success will come anyway. Um, you won't have to look for it. It will come naturally and it, um, whatever you, you define success, it doesn't matter, but it will come. Be conscious of what I do, of what I want, of what I don't want, um, why I'm doing that and how I'm doing that. And I really want to be conscious of who I am right now and where am I and to be conscious of the person that I want to be. So this last theme is really in relation uh, with my last video about minimalism because there is a lot of connection between those two themes and yeah, minimalism is a one way to be conscious of who I am and what I'm doing and the impact that I have on planet. So yeah, this is already the end of the video. I hope that you liked it. Um, if you do, please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel. If you're not already subscribed, it will make me very happy and I'll see you next week with a new video. And don't forget to um, write your own theme in the comment below. I would be so happy to know them. Bye. <laughs>